the third ranked Oregon State Beavers taking on the surprising Colorado Buffaloes. Oregon State withstanding an early charge by Colorado to win it 72 to 60. Rich Burke along with Jordan Canada here at Gill Coliseum. Colorado played well particularly early on but Oregon State took command of the second quarter. 23 to 9 run and how about Destiny Slocum. Destiny Slocum was excellent tonight. She was getting all of the looks that she wanted. Four for three from the three point line. You see that hand in her face. It doesn't matter. She's able to knock it down. She can get to the basket with ease and they just kept going under the screens and she was confident enough to shoot that shot and knock it down. Yep, she hit four of the eight three pointers for Oregon State. Michaela Pivik, 15 points, 16 rebounds, and eight assists, almost a triple double. What is it that she cannot do? She was able to control the floor of the game tonight. Despite not being the highlight with Destiny Slocum, she was able to get do her job and get it done. Just getting on the glass, getting old boards, finding her teammates, and scoring when needed. Michaela Pivik, the conference leader in rebounding at five foot ten and did nothing to damage that tonight with the 15 boards. Taylor Jones had her fifth career double double as she went for 16 and 10. It's easy to play with a post player who loves to keep their hands high and is able to score with ease. And all you have to do is just throw it up to her because you know she's going to finish layups day in and day out. And you saw it six blocks as well. And so Taylor Jones, the freshman out of Texas, Another fine game in Oregon State. Uh, their second smallest margin of victory this year. The previous smallest have been 11. They win this one by 12. 39% from the floor for Oregon State, 32% for Colorado. I'll tell you what, this Buffs team is going to be fine. They showed some spirit in this one. And you can see, I mean, look, 27 points to the seven points from coming from off the bench. That's huge. And only five turnovers in this game. I mean, they didn't have the game go their way, but the fact that they only had five turnovers throughout the whole game just speaks volumes to how good they can be. Yeah, Pino Tutele, 15 points. Maya Hollingshed, 14. Jalen Sherrod, the freshman point guard, 13 for Colorado. Oregon State, they matched the school record 14 consecutive wins. They're 14 and 0 to begin the season. 10 and 0 here at Gill Coliseum. They beat Colorado today, 72 to 60. Oregon State is now 2-0 in conference play, and Colorado falls to 1-2.